I had a little time to kill before a meeting, so I thought I'd do another Walking the Tube video. Today we're going to go from Westminster to Embankment. We'll take the scenic route. Turn left out of the main entrance of Westminster Underground Station, then left again under the statue of Boudicca, and walk along the Victoria Embankment. On the right is Westminster Pier. If you want a scenic view of the city centre, a boat trip is quite without pier. <laughs> yeah. That little green building down there contains equipment used to measure the tide. Politicians should make more use of it. Maybe they'd be able to tell when the tide was turning against them, he said satirically. On the left is Portcullis House, which is part of the parliamentary estate. The architecture is intended both to evoke the Gothic stylings of the Houses of Parliament and the feeling of a ship. This is particularly true on the inside, which I've never seen. Moving on. On the left there is New Scotland Yard, just a short distance from regular Scotland Yard, which lies off Whitehall. I didn't film here for long because that's a pretty good way to get lifted by the polis. There are a lot of memorials and statues along here, which, in the space of a short video, I don't really have time to go into individually. Um, if you'd like a video looking at these, let me know in the comments section. I do rather like these two, though. This ship is the Tattershall Castle, a paddle steamer built as a Humber ferry in 1934. I must admit I'm not a huge fan for, of it. I find the restoration unsympathetic. It's removed a lot of its original features in favour of unimaginative replacements. It's now a popular floating pub. I'm reliably informed by a friend in the pub trade that managing it is a very tough gig. There are currently construction works going on by the riverside, so I decided to go through Whitehall Gardens. The present green space was laid out in 1875 as a pleasant way to cover up the sewer and underground railway that run underneath. It's sometimes confused with the privy garden of the Palace of Whitehall, which was actually to the left of this, uh, as we're going, and no longer exists. On the left is Northumberland Avenue, pink on the Monopoly board and one of those delightful cabman's shelters, which I often think I should do a video on. Finally, we pass under Hungerford Bridge, leading into Charing Cross Station, and there we are at Embankment Station, and our final destination.